802.1x exists. And um, that's the thing about how good of a protocol it is. And um, MAC address filtering on layer two is probably the actual way to go. And, um, you know, I don't know very much about networks. And I my SCADA network is a wide area network. But um, I, I didn't even think about that, which means that I'm not thinking about actual security, but then I'm also thinking, you know, where can I put an IDS? Where do I need an IDS? Um, where do I need a firewall? Um, like a dedicated firewall. And that's the thing about like what, I think it, no matter what, it's a wide area network for cameras. So I was wrong again. And I think I'm, I have a strong tendency towards being wrong in anything that I don't know about. Um, but, um, Things I do know about, I'm right in. Wait, no, probably not. Actually, I think I think that's why the CIA teaches you what they teach you, which is don't ever make assumptions, because it's really easy to assume. You know, like this guy's crazy, but then you realize, okay, how many bomb bomb makers does he know? Well, two military one not military and I don't I mean and now it's crazy how self-conscious I am because it's like okay you can't be president now it's like well um, so if you've talked to other people like if you've gone public and, and gone against me in a campaign then um, can't you talk to me too so um, I guess that's kind of the goal so like I mean because I'm not social enough right like I, I, I don't have enough friends I, he only interacts with his family, but he doesn't interact very well because he's so pissed off all the time. But then, if you think about who I interact with, it's everyone I don't know. Only people I don't know. Pretty much. Like, everyone I interact with, I do not know them. And so it's like, no, he's not going to be able to handle interacting with people he doesn't know. It's like, okay, the only people he knows are people he doesn't know. I mean, that's that's the thing. It's like, alright, do you understand what, what type of person I am? I have moved my entire life since elementary school. Since, like, I mean, kindergarten through third, new school. Fourth through fifth, new school. Sixth, new school. Sixth again, new school. Um, ninth, new school. I'm not going to go through all my new, but all I'm saying is, everyone I know always is, is someone I don't know. So, it's like, all right. Everyone is super confused about Pete Buttigieg. Yeah, me too. Um, that's the thing about super powerful government companies. Um, it's it's really confusing when it's like a government intelligence company. Yeah. Okay, so the government gives them money to spy on people. Well, may, no, that's not them. That's like how many thousands, 3,000 companies do that? But that's not McKinley and Company or McKinsey and Company. McKinsey and Company is consulting, right? I don't even know what you guys do. And so that's the thing about me, like being like, I don't even know because I'm so pissed off about other stuff. And then I'm like, I can't talk about guns apparently because the number one thing you're not allowed to be in a Democratic campaign for president in Iowa is someone that likes guns. That's, that's just kind of how it works. And I, I, but, but in the whole Democratic Party, basically, especially once you get into urban areas where, like, where do you really get the votes? Well, California, New York, Florida, um, Illinois, Texas. I mean, let's think, let's think about this. Missouri, Wisconsin, I feel like, is going my way which for some reason Wisconsin thinks I have to quit smoking pot yeah all right so um that's cool oh oh because Wisconsin has Milwaukee I didn't realize how big Milwaukee is really because it's so close to Chicago and Chicago's getting so expensive but then you have all sorts of cool places at least you have Madison you have terrible weather though anyways so where else is big I don't even know. Is Oregon big? That's the thing. I, I don't really know where Oregon stands at all. Who's big? I think I listed them. 
Washington D.C. How much? How many delegates do you have? Because it's not that big. I feel like it's big. All right. So that's the thing. When you think about a real raise, like a real campaign, and then you think, okay, well, okay, Offset has he won a Grammy? Like, do I mean? Is Lizzie dating a cop because he can carry a gun? That's like he has that right, and that's helpful. I mean, I, I mean probably not. Probably because he's the best. Because he probably is actually the best. But all I'm saying is, um, let's think about this. Like, can I win in rural areas? I don't know. Um, I don't know how. Isn't Georgia pretty big? But then. Everyone might get mad at me for saying racist stuff, but I, I don't think so. I think they'd get mad at me about guns because everyone gets so worried about guns. Because, dude, I understand, but I don't know. At least I'm not a liar. Like, that's the thing about me. Like, I I am too much of a truth sayer, and then it's like, uh-oh. Like, you have to understand, like, when a virus breaks out, no matter how bad it is, like, people think it's us and they want a piece of that because we because i say stuff like that and i mean how, how many viruses have broken out not that many i mean i don't know i don't know i don't know didn't they find like 30 something of them in an iceberg but i don't even know about viruses at all whatsoever so it's like oh you go talk it's like um not my thing like totally failed biology probably because really i just i was a bad kid in middle school and if you're a bad kid in middle school, it's going to really mess you up when, when you get to high school, for sure. And if you're too bad of a kid in high school, you're going to really, really, really not do well in college. Because in college, yeah, sometimes it's college is hard if you're a bad kid too, depending on where you are. I don't know. I don't know. That's the thing. I, I think that people don't realize how serious life is. And they don't understand how serious Pete Buttigieg is. Seriously. Seriously. 